Chapter 2 Advanced Xing Yuan Grass looking at Zhao Wanting's appearance, Lin Yi had the urge to say things directly. But he held back. The most important thing for him now is to hold on. This kind of big opportunity, no matter who he tells, will increase the risk of exposure. He is currently weak and cannot bear any risks. After dinner, Zhao Wanting reluctantly left. Lin Yi began to think about cultivation. There is definitely a problem with Blue Star's aura. Concentration. After being transformed by the wood type divine crystal, he has an excellent spiritual root talent. If he is in the world of immortal cultivation, he can make great progress in one practice. But at Blue Star, after cultivating for a whole afternoon, he refined a few traces of green wood spiritual power, which is really different. Since the concentration of aura in the air is too low, then find a way to gather the spiritual energy. Lin Yi turned his attention to clover. Isn't there a ready-made solution? Xing Yuan grass is equivalent to a small natural gathering spirit formation, and with the increase in its number, the degree and scope of gathering spirit energy will also increase accordingly. Is there anything more suitable than this? Lin Yi tapped his finger on a clover, and the green aura of green wood leaked out from his finger and entered the delicate clover. It was as if a long drought had met the rain, and almost in an instant, the clover absorbed the Aoki spiritual energy, and its size doubled in size within a few seconds. This peculiar clover stands out among a bunch of clover, and is very conspicuous. No problem this time, it's indeed a clover. Originally, Lin Yi was still a little uncertain, but seeing clovers change like this, he knew he didn't admit his mistake. It is estimated that there is too little aura in the air, and the clover, which should be the thickness of an arm, has shrunk to such a size. With the injection of Aoki's spiritual power, the true face of the clover was gradually revealed. After observing the state of the clover, Lin Yi muttered to himself, Not enough, not enough, not enough spiritual power. It takes spiritual power to restore the clover to its normal state, and it also requires spiritual power to upgrade the clover into a star grass. Compared with his daily cultivation, it is a drop in the bucket. But these can be overcome. Lin Yi's eyes are firm, and there is hope that he can survive. He is already very satisfied. No matter how many difficulties and obstacles on the way, compared with death, it is nothing at all. Ten days later, on the edge of a steep cliff, the trees were overgrown with clouds, and a young man in civilian clothes slowly opened his eyes in the cloud. As the eyes of a asterisk asterisk burst into a gleaming look, he said softly to himself, finally I have enough. This young man is Lin Yi. In the past ten days, he has visited all the historical sites and places with lush vegetation in B.S. City. After many comparisons, he chose this place with a higher altitude as the training ground. The concentration of spiritual energy here did not disappoint him, making his cultivation efficiency three times as much as when he was living in Fengshan Mountain. Today, he finally accumulated enough spiritual power for advanced clover. He rushed home without stopping. When he opened the door, he saw a half-height clover in the middle of the courtyard. This clover was about the thickness of a child's arm. Although it only had three leaves, the three leaves were dotted with stars. From a distance, it looks like a starry sky. It's really beautiful. 
Lin Yi exclaimed. For the past ten days, every day he has injected the Aoki. Spiritual power obtained by refining into this clover. The cultivating effect of Aoki's. Spiritual power on plants is most vividly reflected in clover. Now, with one last infusion, clover can advance. Lin Yi was very excited, but he still took a deep breath and forced himself to calm down. He walked out of the courtyard gate. At this time, the small courtyard was surrounded by a circle of barbed wire. These iron wires were 1.6 meters high. From a close look, there were quite a few iron thorns on each wire, which made people timid. After confirming that there was no emission, Lin Yi turned on the power and powered on the wire net. The small courtyard was completely surrounded by energized barbed wire, and then, with his right hand, he picked up the solid steel harpoon bought at the hardware store. Under such protection, Lin Yi's heart calmed down a little. When he cultivated to the third day, he suddenly thought of what a spirit grass meant to this world where the concentration of spiritual energy was scarce. He didn't know if there were other spiritual things in this world, but he knew that in the great world of immortality, there were alien beasts guarding every spiritual thing. Beasts are far stronger than humans in the field of perception, which allows them to quickly discover unknown spirits in the wild. Lin Yi wasn't sure if there were any powerful beasts near Kifeng Mountain, but he still had to be careful. At present, although he has started to cultivate, all the gains from the cultivation are used to cultivate clover, and there is no means of attack. It's not that he doesn't want to break through the realm, but it's this little spiritual energy that he is so reluctant to cultivate a spiritual grass. If he wants to cultivate, he is just dreaming. But with Xing Yu in grass, the situation can be improved. Lin Yi looked at the clover, no longer hesitated, and quickly injected the Aoki spiritual power accumulated in the body into it. When it was half injected, the size of the clover still increased slightly, but when it grew by two centimeters, again, this increase slowed down, as if it had reached a bottleneck. Next, it is the quantitative change that causes the qualitative change. In the trunk of the clover, several small holes were instantly broken, and the green stems and leaves grew out of them at a very fast speed, and the leaves at the top also completed the change from small to large in a very short time. The three-leaf clover completely changed its appearance in just a few seconds. The luxuriant rhizomes, the dotted leaves, and the looming mist lingering around. It's so beautiful. Lin Yi looked at the Xingyuan grass in front of him and exclaimed. Although I have seen it several times. In my memory, I still feel shocked when I see it in reality. Not to mention the efficacy, just by looking at it like this you can tell that it is not an ordinary plant. At the same time that Xing Yu and Sao advanced successfully, the function of gathering spiritual energy also took effect. Simultaneously, from a perspective that is invisible to ordinary people, within 500 meters, the spiritual energy slowly converges to the Xing Yu and grass in the center of the circle. The aura moved very fast, and after a while, Lin Yi felt an obvious change. The concentration of aura in the air of the small courtyard has more than tripled in a very short period of time, and the rate of increase is only showing signs of slowing down. The gathering of large-scale spiritual energy is not only reflected in the air, the flowers and plants inside and outside the courtyard are affected. 
Under the nourishment of spiritual energy, these plants are unusually lively and delicate. The rest of the clover has also grown a bit visibly to the naked eye. After the changes in the spiritual energy in the yard were completely stabilized, Lin Yi carefully sensed the changes in the concentration of spiritual energy. Five times. It turned out to be five times the previous. Lin Yi's eyes lit up and his brows were happy. The best cultivation sites he has found in the past few days are far from the same in terms of the concentration of spiritual energy. A single Xing Yuan grass really brought earth-shaking changes, and his efforts over the past few days were not wasted. Such a concentration of spiritual energy can already support his initial cultivation. But as soon as Lin Yi was in the mood, there was a heavy stomping on the ground outside the courtyard. Then, there was a voice that was both familiar and unfamiliar. Humph. No. It's a wild boar. Lin Yi realized who the owner of the voice was, and his face changed drastically. There has always been a saying in the mountains that there is one pig, two bears and three tigers. Wild boars are more harmful to humans than bears than tigers. Lin Yi was very sure that there were absolutely no wild animals larger than medium size on the Kifeng Mountain where he was located. This wild boar was definitely attracted by Xing Yuan Sao from other hills. For the first time facing such a ferocious wild animal, Lin Yi was a little flustered in his heart, but he quickly calmed down. After all, he also made some preparations in the small courtyard before finally pouring his spiritual power. Picking up the harpoon, he hurried to the second floor. The second floor has a wide field of vision, and you can clearly see what is happening outside the yard. I saw a huge black-haired wild boar wandering restlessly outside the power grid. There is a very conspicuous scar on its pig head. The scar is charred black and smoking. The grid that the pig head is facing also has traces of damage. Obviously, before Lin Yi came up, the wild boar had already had a preliminary confrontation with the power grid he arranged. The four legs of the black-haired wild boar didn't stop for a moment. The pig's head was dangling, looking for a way to break through the obstacles ahead, looking very excited. Maybe he couldn't bear it. Maybe he couldn't find any other loopholes. The black-haired wild boar no longer struggled, lowered his head, and rammed straight towards the grid that was already showing signs of damage. Lin Yi stared. Yu Yu reading www. Ukanshu.com does not miss a detail. He didn't set up any more traps. If the power grid was really broken, he would have to do it himself. Fortunately, things didn't go in the worst direction. Accompanied by shrill screams and a scorched smell, the black-haired wild boar fell under the electric shock of high voltage electricity. The sturdy physique made it not lose his life in an instant even if his blood was blurred. However, it didn't do any useless work. The power grid, which had no dead ends, was forced to smash a long and narrow gap with its brute force. Fortunately, Lin Yi looked around and found that apart from this wild boar, no other animals were attracted. Let's deal with this big guy first. If someone else finds out, it's not easy to explain. Lin Yi went downstairs, disconnected the power supply, walked not far from the black-haired wild boar, and lightly touched its head with a harpoon. The head of the black-haired wild boar moved slightly, and the remaining hairs that were not electro-scorched stood up, making a warning gesture. 
its nerves and muscles, were paralyzed and weak under the action of the electric shock, and it could not perform other actions at all. Lin Yi narrowed his eyes slightly, raised his harpoon, and the sharp head of the fork flashed a cold light. As long as he thrusts down on its head, the black-haired wild boar will die on the spot. But when Lin Yi raised the harpoon to the highest point and was about to make a move to insert it, he gently put the harpoon down again. Sharp perception, strong physique, it seems like a waste to kill like this. If you can tame it. Lin Yi looked at the black head. Wild boar lying on the ground, thoughtful. Moreover, the effect of the Xing Yuan grass is continuous, and sooner or later other beasts will be attracted. If it helps at that time, I seem to be able to relax.